Well, introducing CarMax Park. That is the name of what will become the new home of Richmond's Flying Squirrels. 8 News reporter Sierra Krug joins us live outside of the place we all know is the diamond. Only a few more days before total transformation begins. Sierra. Well, Deanna, Eric, that is right. In honor of this major milestone, Richmond Mayor LaVar Stoney officially declared this week Squirrels Week. Community members joined together earlier today celebrating this long term project finally beginning to come to life. Ladies and gentlemen, Nutsy and Natasha would like to welcome you to our new home. Cries of relief and hope celebrating the end of a 15 year battle and the beginning of a new chapter for baseball in Richmond. Look at Richmond 10 years from now, and this will be certainly the catalyst for what the future will look like. City leaders like Mayor LeVar Stoney and Flying Squirrels leaders like Todd Parney Parnell announcing a 30-year deal with the homegrown business CarMax, loading the bases for Richmond's highly anticipated new ballpark, CarMax Park. So we're a match made in heaven, right? But no, we're a match made in Richmond. Years ago, Major League Baseball threatened if the historic diamond didn't get a revamp, it would be game over for the team. Even Flying Squirrels president, Lou DiBella himself, started to lose hope. Went through a great period of pessimism, and including, frankly, six or eight months ago, I couldn't have told you I thought we'd be here today. It's been a roller coaster, but we never will get now Wednesday, the first step into the future. Project coordinators for the larger scale Diamond District anticipate concerts, festivals, community gatherings. They say the site will be available around the clock, 365 days a year. So every Richmonder feels like they have a new home base here for good. I am proud to say that the squirrels are here to stay. The squirrels are here to stay. The squirrels are here to stay. As you could see and hear, there were definitely a lot of cheers, but things even got emotional for some. Mayor Stoney says he's saving his tears for Friday. That's when the official groundbreaking is happening. Love in Richmond, Sierra Krug, 8 News.